Hi, I'm Stephen Featherston. Uh, I work for Eco Home Tech in uh, Doncaster, South Yorkshire, and I've taken the opportunity of visiting uh, one of our most recent customers to go through the equipment that uh, they've had installed so you can see what the uh, possibilities are. Hi Dennis, when, when you first considered the heating and hot water side, what sort of equipment were you considering? What made you choose the equipment that you finally ended up with? Well, we were clearly wanting to do our bit for the environment. Uh, the green aspect's really important. Escalating uh, gas and electricity prices paid or played a, a, a major impact in the decision. Uh, you know, it's purely down to cost. What made you decide to approach Eco Home Tech? I was looking for a, a one-stop shop, if you like, somebody that would design it, a company that would uh, install it and then maintain it. And having decided to go with Eco Home Tech for the range of equipment, um, what do you think the quality of the service that you finally received? Excellent from start to finish, really. Uh, just, where I w just what we were looking for. Now that everything's up and running and you've moved into your very nice house, let me say, how do you find things as far as efficiency and running is concerned now? It's everything that we wanted. Everything that I planned, the, the underfloor eating, never had it before, and it really is worth every, every penny. Uh, it's a different kind of warmth, totally. Uh, feel quite smug about the solar aspect as well, knowing that every time you turn the shower on or the tap, it's all there and it's not paying for it. So now everything's up and running, of course, you're more than happy with the equipment that's been installed for you? It's uh, beyond our expectations, really. Uh, just what I wanted. Absolutely just what we wanted. If this is the type of equipment that you are interested in, the type of service that you're interested in, if you'd like to contact me, Stephen Featherstone at Eco Home Tech, then the contact details on the website and the email address are below.